Amir Khan has reiterated his opinion that Canelo Alvarez should be banned for life from boxing because of the failed doping tests earlier on this year. So I'm going to quote Amir Khan here. He says, at the end of the day, I'm just focusing on my career first and making sure I do everything and I don't make any mistakes. Look, there are some big names out there in boxing. I'm focusing on them. I'm on my path in boxing and Canelo, whatever he did, he did wrong. But I just think it's wrong for boxing to do that because we work so hard. And when we work so hard, someone that takes drugs should be banned for good, should be banned forever. Not only given a six month ban. Because Canelo's so big in the business that people are going to respect him, the boxing media are going to back him. The promoters are going to back him. He brings a lot of money to the table. So they want to respect him. They want to keep him in boxing. So those are the words of Amir King Khan. Now, if it wasn't Khan saying this, I'm pretty sure that there wouldn't be anybody in the comment section to this video saying anything other than Canelo should be banned for life, or at least Canelo should be banned for several years. But because it's Khan saying it, there are going to be people saying, ah, oh, Khan's salty, Khan needs to shut up, Khan needs to stop making excuses. There are going to be loads of people saying that because Khan is a very divisive figure in boxing. Personally, I think Khan is one of the top two most entertaining boxers and characters in British boxing of all time for me, for me personally. I'm not saying everybody has to agree with me, but in terms of my personal opinion, the fighters who I've found entertaining in and out of the ring, you know, I'm talking about the combination of their fights and also outside the ring as personalities. Amir Khan to me is just entertainment right across the board. Outside the ring entertainment, inside, you know, and outside the ring, I don't think he intends to be entertaining. It just so happens that he is, to me at least. Inside the ring, I mean, sometimes he don't <laughs> intend to be entertaining either. <laughs> but it happens. So, yeah. Uh, Khan, for me, great value for money. In and out of the ring. And I always look forward to his fights. I always look forward to his interviews. Because <laughs> I know he's going to upset people. People get pissed off when Amir Khan does interviews. And that actually makes me enjoy the interview even more. <laughs> Whenever I see a Khan story like this. Or there was actually an interview he did the other day. Where he was asked about Kel Brook. And he said, does Kel Brook even want to fight? And I was creasing. I'm telling you. Khan, he just loves trolling Kel Brook. Can you imagine? The guy who has wanted to fight Khan more than anybody else in the world. And Khan knows this. And he's been calling Khan out for years. For Khan to turn around and say, does Brook even want to fight? I mean, that's trolling on a whole new level. <laughs> so, shout out to Amir Khan, man. Value for money. I don't care what nobody says. This guy's value for money. And for those of you wondering who is the other guy in the top two for me in terms of most entertaining British fighter in and out of the ring, for me, it has to be Chris Eubank Sr. Now, there are some fighters who are entertaining in the ring, British fighters I'm talking about, more entertaining in the ring than Khan and Eubank, definitely. People like Prince Nassim, you know, Nigel Benn. These guys were more entertaining if you're just talking about in the ring, then Khan and Eubank. But the combination of the two things, in and out of the ring, for me, Khan and Eubank Sr. are the two top guys. <laughs> Hilarious. So, uh, I mean, Eubank Sr., even today, after retiring how many decades ago? 15, 20 years ago, whenever he retired, Eubank Sr. is still entertaining today, at least to me. I mean, it all comes down to personal preference at the end of the day uh, we've all got different senses of humor but for my sense of humor Eubank Senior was still today is hilarious you know very entertaining I know he says he don't tell jokes and all that stuff but to me it's hilarious so anyway let me know how you feel about what Amir Khan has said here drop your comments in the comment section below it should be fun <laughs> all right it's that man I'm out